It's your first chance to see the Titans live on the practice field as they gear up for the new season. From 5 to 7 o'clock tonight, the team is holding open practices for the public to come and watch. Oh, first time at Nissan, baby. Now let's go to work. Oh, feeling feel feisty today. Let's go do it. Let's go do it. Tighten up your footwork, Perk. Good. Keep those feet going. Keep the feet going. This is a tight end group that is very, very much unknown. Luke Stocker was brought in to help bolster that depth. He is a player who this team is intimately familiar with. There you go. There you go. There you go. Stock. Nice. 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 Ready to run through it. Here you go, Tommy. Here you go, Tommy. There it is. There it is. I like Tommy Hudson. I like what he did today. He did a nice job in the inside run drill. They also have play action pass in it. He did a nice job of finding the open spaces and the open parts. In the run part of it, he did a good job of walling off on the outside with, with the outside zone. Hey, way to run off the ball, Ferk. Nice job. Good juice. Anthony Ferkser's role within this offense remains a fascination. How does he further his craft turning into a more fuller version of the tight end position? Is it necessary for him to do that? You've seen him get a lot of good work throughout the course of the last couple weeks in training camp. I see you working, Ferk. I see you working. That's a great angle coming out. Good job, get some water, man. Get some water. Appreciate your work ethic. Ferkser just continues to show up in two-minute drills. That's the world he lives in. He did a nice job again today in the two-minute drill. Hey, there you go. Just lock that thing away, man. It's got to be one motion. Gotta be quicker, uh, be quicker. Uh, uh. Gotta be even quicker. Ferg, you break that habit. You're gonna catch so many balls this year. All right, we'll make this short and sweet. Take care of your bodies. Take care of your bodies. Take advantage of the travel day. All right, we got no walkthrough. We got no practice. Hydrate. Take care of your bodies. Stock, you got us. Let's go, tight end. Three, one, two, three, tight end. Welcome in live from the Titans joint training camp practices with the defending Super Bowl champion, Tampa Bay Buccaneers. We are pleased to be out here. Beautiful weather in scenic, sunny Tampa Bay. A lot of, uh, a lot of good work gotten out here for a lot of dudes who need it. Nick Westbrook Aquina is one player that I think can come out of these uh, the two days of practice against Tampa Bay feeling pretty good about himself because both days he just continues to make catches the titans defense did get some good work in over the course of the last couple of days against tom brady pass rush is not designed here to get home they're not knocking down tom brady i mean they are making an effort to get a good rep against the offensive line in front of them but they're not taking down brady so if anything, Brady should have the ability to make more plays against this Titan secondary. Yesterday, he had three picks. He was picked off three different times. I said that before we came down here, it's going to be a great measuring stick for us to see, you know, where we at as a defense. And like I said, it's good because we obviously know we got some things to clean up, but not going against our offense, seeing another offense, seeing, understanding the type of different things that we can communicate and, and check and not really game plan against the team. It's just a great couple of days of practice. Opportunity is the key word right now at this point of the National Football League preseason. Opportunity for those young players that you just mentioned that now have a second chance against an opponent that's not their team that they can show what they want to do. They, they have to start separating themselves in ball games. Let's get it now. Two receivers to the right, one to the left. Gabbard looking, pumping. David Long. Barkley on fourth down. Play fake. Barkley rolling, throwing in the flat. It's caught. It's Sergeant. Touchdown, Titans. 19 seconds remaining in the quarter. Titans seven, Bucks nothing. Going to throw it. Fires deep down the middle for Hudson, who makes the catch, loses the ball. The Titans have it. To the 40, to the 35, to the 30, to the 25, to the 20. Body Calhoun to the 15, to the 10, to the 5, to the end zone. Touchdown, Titans! Hudson caught the pass over the middle, took a hit from McDougal, lost the ball, and Briad Body Calhoun comes up with it 
and returns it for a touchdown. Woodside with a play fake. Fires downfield, man is there, Fitzpatrick. Touchdown, tight! Is that the play that gets Des Fitzpatrick's pilot light lit? Crask, dropping, feeling some heat up the middle, throws, ball up in the air and intercepted. 50, 40, to the outside, to the 30, it's gathers and he's taken down at the 25. Barkley looking, looking, firing downfield for Kinsey. Touchdown, Titans! What a catch! Mason Kinsey! New score with 11.03 to go. Tennessee Titans 34, Tampa Bay Buccaneers 3. Feeling heat, hit by Molden. Oh, 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 Save! What a great rush! Elijah Molden! Crask with quick throw, Mickens, belted by! <laughs> Molden <laughs> lost his helmet, and the box lost yardage. Have yourself a day, young man. Blitz coming. Trask fires. Man wide open down the middle. It's intercepted on a deflection. Carter, 40, 30, 20, and he is taken down at the 15. And Jamal Carter spreads forward with another takeaway, third turnover of the night. And we are done. Final score, Tennessee 34, Tampa Bay 3, as the Titans come to Tampa and get it done again.